What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video and back to kind of the, the showcases that I've been doing a little bit where I show you guys my first experience with every fighter. I just want to say thank you for the support recently and today we're using Sugar Ray Robinson. Now off rip I'm going to say I didn't realise how OP this man was, he is a beast and his combination punching is fantastic. But as you can see, 92 overall, fighting style is a boxer puncher so he works well on the outside, he works well on the inside. Off my limited use of him, I would recommend a few outside shots, get on the inside, launch together some combinations, and get out. That was how I kind of used him in this fight. You can see his stats there. Sorry, guys, for the abrupt cut. I pressed the wrong button, but you can see the stats there. If we go across to the more detailed stats, we can see some key ones such as 96 head health, 96 endurance, 97 movement speed, 96 punch speed, 96 counter punching, 96 jab, hook, and straights, 95 swelling resistance, 95 cut resistance, 92 chin resistance, 94 block health. So as you can imagine, you could really tuck up on the ropes, wait, 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 and then you could launch off jab, hook, uppercut, hook, get away. You, it, it would be that easy because he is so fast, he is so useful, and he is a great, great fighter. And to be honest, they've really done him justice when it comes to such a legend. He has two traits. Uh, he has Rock'em Sock'em and the Prince. Rock'em Sock'em is increased damage of uppercuts thrown to the head by 20%, uh, as well as increased day's chance on uppercuts thrown by 10%. So that is a uh, inside fighting trait, as you can imagine. You're going to want to use the uppercuts on the inside. However, the Prince, in turn, is increased damage on all directional punches by 10%. However, the negative to that is punches when standing still have a 5% reduced damage. If you're going to stand still, you're going to want to use those uppercuts to initiate the Rock'em Sock'em trait. But if you're on the move, you're going to want to be using the directional punches, which is the Prince trait. So they really have created him to be an inside and an outside fighter, and in turn, a boxer puncher fighting style. Uh, an absolutely fantastic um, fighter. I think he looks stunning as well, just visually. But anyways, uh, this was a bit of a mismatch fight. But as always, I'll, um, these showcases aren't win or lose. These are just, you know, regardless of what happens, win, lose or draw. I want to show you guys my first experience with every fight. is Because um, you guys know I'm not the best in the world. But uh, I sure want to at least have some videos that are entertaining. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Enjoy. Okay, Sugar Ray Robinson. I have not used him before, but we're going to be giving it a go. We're going to be fighting on the outside, because you know that's how I like to do things. This one is only a 10-rounder, as opposed to the usual 12-rounders that we do on the channel. Now, I'm not expecting to get him out early. Shiro Robinson has great individual punches, but not great hand power or punch power. But if I put the combinations together right, there's no reason why I can't put him down. Oh, Sugar Ray Robinson has the nastiest combinations. Let's get a bit of loose movement going, shall we? Get a bit, a bit of loose movement. Oof, miss me. Oof, miss me again. Oof. Turn that loose movement off now. Oh, he feels really good, you know. He feels really good. Just dig into the body like that. He feels good. Oof. Took that. Took that round. Took that round for sure. Could just be a lot of me outboxing him, to be honest. I might try and mix it up, you know, fart on the inside a little bit. Jet. 
It's trying to put the put the pace on me a little bit. Oh, put the uppercuts in there as well. Nice, nice. Okay, he's picking up on the movement a little bit. Oh, a little back step lead hook there. Oh. Just taunting him a little bit. <laughs> Just taught him a little bit. It's not often that you are not running into lots of OP fighters. That's why I like to try and fight a variety of opponents. Oh my god, the combination I'm putting together there. I think me and Sugar Ray Robinson actually look a lot alike. That's why I, I'm so good with him in game because we are actually the same person. Oh. Nice rips to the body. Okay, I was just piecing him up there, absolutely piecing him up. He didn't win that 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 third round. I call absolute BS on that. Oof. I'm getting a bit carried away because I know um, Michael McKinson is a pretty low rated fighter. So I'm not really respecting him much, to be honest with you.
Yeah, I'm not really respecting him, to be honest. Sugar Ray Robinson allows you to do that. To just not respect anyone. Oh. So now I'm going to put the pressure on a little bit. Yeah, um, McKinson's in that survival mode, you know, Shigeru Robinson you can put together, as you can see, you can fight on the outside, you can fight on the inside, you can put together these combinations, he is a freak of nature. Look at the, look at the combinations you can put together, just... Shuffle on that boy. Look at the. <sighs> oh, my Lord. Oh my lord, how is he eating this? He's got to be hurt, surely. See, I'm not really much of a pressure guy, but now I'm going to put it on him. I'm going to put the mustard on him. I'm going to put it on him now. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to put it on him. Oh, yeah, he's eaten these combinations and it's kind of tough to see. Can he get up though? It was only a light body shot to put him down, to be honest. But he's up, he's up, he's up. He's not far off, you know, a couple of four or five punch combinations that's going to put him down because Sugar Ray Robinson's combinations are insane. I thought he got me then, to be honest. Damn it. I was hoping on his way down I could hit him in the head, but I, I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. 
eight, nine, ten. It's all over. Sugar Ray Robinson is insane. He is actually insane. What a one-sided battering that was. Oh my god. Absolutely hammered him. Yeah, a beatdown indeed. And he actually took a couple of rounds as well. I didn't see it playing out like that, to be honest. I thought I was going to hammer him. Something major. What round did he win? Round three? I don't believe so. And round five. I mean, I was out striking him, putting those combinations together, hurting him bad. Great fight and... I have to say, they have done Sugar Ray Robinson absolute justice in this game. Nothing but respect they've put into building him in this game. Incredible. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Drop a like, subscribe. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.